So for your mind now, if the person chat me, start asking me if persuasion is real or fake, I will tell the person the persuasion is real, is fake, is fake, right? If you leave that place, you go and tell persuasion, I wanted to help you, but authority voice said that you are a fake man of God. Make you not get sense. Hello, man of God. Happy New Week. How are you doing over there? That's life now. Two days, we never talk. Hope all is well. Dosa, according to Benin, they say do. Please, I want to ask you, concerning this uh, Pastor Destiny's issue, eh? like, I don't know. Some I, I went through the comment section, and some people are saying that it's... Uh, it's not real that it's a prank, something like that. And it's kind of it's kind of depriving him from getting help from those that really wants to help him concerning the I think financial help that they are requesting for. So I want to confirm from you, at least you you know so much about them now. Is it real or prank? Because I don't know. This is I think this is not the first, neither is it the second or third that he has been beaten like this, beaten to stupor like this. I think the first one was even untouchable that came to rescue him, something like that. And a lot that has been, you know, happening. And this one to another one, in which they are even requesting for help. I went through the comment section and there's this man that is willing to, you know, help him out financially to foot his his hospital bill but the reply concerning you know this um his some people's reply to him it's kind of discouraging they are saying that the man shouldn't mind he shouldn't care that that he should ignore that the, the whole thing is rng the whole thing is is planned work that is all uh, pranks that they are not real I don't understand. So I don't know. I said I want to confirm from you because I had to chat the man up, tell him that he should, you know, verify from you. Do you understand? That he should verify from you. I gave him your your page. That he should help me ver like verify from you before, you know, sending whatever he wants to send to them. Because I was just trying to convince him. You know, so he won't believe those people trying to discourage him. So I want you to, you know, tell me. I want to know if, at least if it is real or maybe the, Pastor Destiny is not fake now. Pastor Destiny is not one of those pranksters. So why are people who against him like this is what I don't know. Because it's, it's kind of discouraging those that are willing to help him financially. So the thing is just pissing me off. Just pissing me off, honestly. The person that's sending me these voice notes is my fans. Don't ask me this kind of question. I will still reply you on WhatsApp. But when I'm making this video, maybe another person is going to ask me this thing. Somebody wants to ask me this kind of question. If Pastor Destiny is real or fake. For your mind, if he is fake, I will come and tell you that he is a fake man of God. I don't talk like that. I believe in reality and the fact. I don't talk like that. You can't just be asking me that this man wants to help us with this. Uh, many people are discouraging him in the comment section that he's, uh, that some say that they should not mind, mind him that, and the man wants to pay the full hospital bill, that he should not mind him. They now give the person my number, right? To chat me, to ask me if Pasodesini is real or fake. They could not get sense. So. Get sense. You know, even tell me before giving out my number. Get sense, so. Okay, you, it's like you give the person my page, something like that. So for your mind now, if the person chat me, start asking me if persuasion is real or fake, I will tell the person the persuasion is real, is fake, is fake, right? If you leave that place, you go and tell persuasion, I wanted to help you, but authority voice said that you are a fake man of God. Make you not get sense, so. There is some question that you're not supposed to ask. There are some questions that are supposed to be asked. Anybody that feel like helping Pastor Destiny should go ahead and help him. Are you helping him with my money? The previous one, I sent him money. My hard earned money. I do it. If you want to send him money, send him money. 
All of the videos somebody is making say that I'm stopping people from saying, send him money if you have money to send. Send. Are you taking the money from my pocket? If you want to pay, whatever you have to do for the man of God, you do it for God. Send him money. It's not from my pocket. If you think that is not is not real, then you leave it. If you think that is real, you send the money. What is my business? You are asking me for me to tell you that Pastor Desi is not real. Let us be careful and the kind of question that we ask. For you, I know that you're going to watch the video. I'm not angry with you, but I'm making the video for any other person. You understand? For any other person. Family, I don't have much thing to say. I as I just play this voice note. I say, let me shout with you guys to hear the kind of question somebody is asking me. To hear the kind of question somebody is asking me. If pastor is a fake man of God, I will come and tell you that he's a fake man of God. Who am I to judge him? Whatever that, whether he's fake or real, he left for him and his God. My main concern is this: let him use money and treat himself. At least when you treat yourself, finish. When they give you hospital bill. You can call out your fans, say, ah, fans, please, they give me hospital bill of maybe 1.5 million, maybe 2 million naira, and I was able to afford 500,000 or 100,000 or 200,000, or I don't even have money. Then the fans will say, okay, this is the bill. One person can even say, okay, I have the money. Okay, take this money and pay for the hospital bill. Take the money and pay for the hospital bill. And the every case will close. But they never, they never give bill. They just take, took him to the hospital. They never give you. So, if you want to pay, no issue. I don't get issue with that. You are not giving me. You are giving to God. I cannot ask you not to give God what you want to give to God. Whatever that you sow in the hand of man of God, you are not sowing it for God, for me, or for the man, for that person. You are sowing it for God. It's God that will reward you. So, this is what I want to say. My name is Authority Voice, a.k.a. the Professor of Betatu. Share the video and drop your opinion in the comment section. One love.